take a pass on getting a routine prostate cancer screening when they go to their doctor. The reason? They say there's little evidence it saves lives. The cancer is slow growing and having the screening can wind up doing more harm than good. The task force concluded that the benefit of PSA screening does not outweigh the known harms that result from diagnosing and treating prostate cancer. The task force originally made the proposal last fall and now it is sticking with it. When prostate cancer is diagnosed, in many cases it will not advance or cause symptoms and is not life-threatening. Currently, there is no way to know definitively which men have a cancer that may benefit from treatment and which men have a cancer that will not cause illness or death if left untreated. Many urologists, however, strongly disagree with the recommendation. Our feeling is that PSA is a valuable test. A lot of training, money, research has gone into the use of PSA. Uh, we like to use PSA. We do not rely on PSA. But our feeling is that it's a, it's a very important and useful screening test. The recommendation isn't a mandate and the task force stresses that men who want a PSA test can still get one. But it says doctors need to tell them about the uncertainties of the screening and the treatment. Ross Simpson, The Associated Press.